Hello everyone. In this video, let us see how to extend maps using data maps. So before defining the data maps, we need to define object definitions for the profiles that are used in these maps. To do so, uh, open the process in the build mode and go to extensions. Now go to object definition tab. Here you can see the profiles for which object definition is not defined. So first we need to define object definition for this profile. To do so, click on one of the profile and choose add object definition option. So this will open a pop-up where we need to provide name and object type. Once we provide these two details, select a profile which you want to add in this particular object type. So once the profiles are selected, click OK. So this will add the profiles to the object definitions. So you can do the same for the remaining profiles also. After clicking OK, now go to data maps. Here you can see all the maps that use these profiles are added as extensions in the data maps tab. So you can see a checkbox here. By default, this checkbox will be enabled. So if you don't want to use any map as extensible map, you can uncheck this particular checkbox. So you have another option that is locking the fields of the source profile and the destination profile also. So once you add the maps in the data maps, click OK and deploy the process to the environment now go to the environment extensions and open data maps tab here we can see that particular map as an extended maps in the environment extensions hope this helps thank you